Hey kids, it's good to be with you here another week to hear a Bible story about Jesus. This week you've been learning as part of your memory work in the Apostles' Creed, this phrase, He ascended into heaven. Of course, you know that Jesus rose from the dead on Easter Day, and then he was with his apostles and his disciples for 40 more days. And then at the end of that 40 days, he took his 11 special disciples, the apostles, and he took them with him up on a high mountain, and then he ascended into heaven, and he went back to the Father. Well, it's a very neat story, and we'll hear about it in just a second, but what does it mean? And we'll talk about that as soon as we get done with the story. Let's listen. During the 40 days following his resurrection, Jesus appeared to his disciples from time to time. He spoke to them about the kingdom of God. On one such occasion, Jesus said to his disciples, Stay in Jerusalem and wait for the gift that my Father has promised, power from on high. Well, the disciples asked, Lord, are you going to restore the kingdom to Israel now? And Jesus replied, It is not for you to know the times or dates the Father has set by his own authority. But you will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes on you, Jesus continued. You will be my witnesses to all that has taken place in Jerusalem, Judea, and Samaria, and to the ends of the earth. After Jesus had said this, he was taken up before their very eyes until a cloud hid him from sight. They were still looking up into the sky when suddenly two angels appeared beside them. The angel said, Why do you stand looking into the sky? This same Jesus who has been taken away from you into heaven will come back in the same way. It's a pretty amazing story. Jesus is there talking with his uh, apostles and then all of a sudden he finishes talking and he starts raising up into the sky. A cloud comes and envelops him, and then phew, he's no longer there. Well, what does this mean for us? Well, Jesus, who had taken on human flesh when he was born, took that humanity back into heaven. And what this means to us and what it declares to us is that heaven is clearly and fully open to us. That we who believe in Jesus, we get to go to heaven to be with God forever when we, when we die, when we pass away. And that's a wonderful gift and a wonderful promise. And that's what Jesus' ascension into heaven means for us, that we get to go to heaven as well.